Come here, you little fucker. Okay, she's chill right now. Oh my god, okay. So this is the Road to 10K episode 5, where we actually achieved the goal. We hit the 10K, but we'll talk about that later. First, I want to intro this video by asking for help. Can someone please help us? Tell us how to potty train a puppy. Because we just got this puppy. This is not Stevie. This kind of looks like Stevie. This is our second dog. She's fucking crazy. Her name is Missy. She's out of her mind. She's pissing and shitting everywhere. Someone help us comment down below. How do you potty train a puppy? I want to put this down. Yeah. Okay. Look. Okay. We just said like this. Okay. Has literally shot on the floor twice just yesterday. Mm -hmm. Pissed on the floor five times yesterday. That's she took life. shit in the kitchen. And then oh, we'll I just see shit footprints <laughs> in we'll, the kitchen. We'll show you that right now. This is shit footprints. All right. Oh, okay, so there's like three or four puddles of piss here. Mm -hmm. All right, let me show this real quick. Don't go anywhere. A puddle of piss. Oh, look, there's shit right oh, there. There's shit right oh, there. Oh, gross. Okay, someone help us. <laughs> and here, look, this is the shit with the footprints. So someone stepped in her shit, <laughs> and there's footprints all the way up. <laughs> footprint there, footprint there. Anyway, I just wanted to get this off our chest and just complain a little bit. Stevie, our other dog, is like the easiest dog ever, so I thought, oh, raising a dog's easy. No, it's not. <sighs> Freaking crazy puppy. Well, let's go in here and talk a little bit about ACX. All right, so like we said, we achieved the road to 10K. Milestone. In, I mean, absolutely insane. And, Five months, we did in, it. In five months, yes. So let's take a look at exactly how much we made this month, well, last month, which was January. Mm -hmm. um, and let's go through the month by month progression from when we first started. We placed our first book order in August, 2018. Okay. Uh, and then August and September, they were being written and being narrated because it can take like eight to 10 weeks to take your audiobook from not existing to existing and on the market making sales. Mm -hmm. So the first sale we made was in October. Mm -hmm. uh, so that was our first income report that we can like document from ACX. October was like $170 in royalties, something like that. And then November 2018 was, we jumped up to 3,700, big jump. Then December 2018 was 8,300. Like so that. we're making big like three thousand dollar a month jumps right now so that was december and then now in january let's open it up and yep. show you the proof mm -hmm. opening up live and there Boom. it is not even ten thousand eleven thousand eleven thousand one hundred twenty nine dollars and seven cents achieved so from when the first book was made January. It took five months. Uh -huh. It took five months from the first book order was made. Yeah. So that shows how quickly you could actually build like a big source of income online. It's like, oh, but didn't you guys put in invest a lot of money? Yes, yes we, did. we did. We invested a lot of money, and that's why we were able to scale the speed. Okay, so let's say how much money did we invest? I think it's about twenty five thousand. About twenty five thousand. About twenty five thousand dollars to make eleven thousand dollars in one month. And we've already we just invested eight thousand dollars more in book orders yeah so i just have a quick thing that i want to say on that regarding the twenty-five thousand that i said we invested that's twenty-five thousand in like a whole bunch of books many of which are still being written and recorded now so they're not up for sale in january we had only 27 audiobooks so we made eleven thousand from just 27 audiobooks and from those 27 audiobooks the total investment was probably around fifteen thousand so not the full 25 just so you know just want to say that. Okay, back in the video. So that was January, and I know in February we'll get the income report a month from now, but we did even more than 11,000, slightly more. Mm -hmm. We got a few more sales and a few more bounties, but not much more. Yeah. Um, because February is a short month. And, and we, didn't, now, we that, didn't have any new books come out, which was annoying. Yeah. And then we're up to 22,000 in two months. Like, my point is, yeah, we put in $25,000 to make 11,000. That's one business, month. baby. That's how, that's how it, how it works. works. Yeah. Um, so that's why we're the ones making a lot of money, because we're out here willing to invest keeps into the business and then in the long run this uh audiobook business will be making hundreds of thousands yeah multiple six figures for us yeah um so yeah profit in the long run okay so there's not much more to say in that but we do have Quick, quickly look really quickly okay. is just our sales dashboard uh 27 total audiobooks yeah. and there's some english ones there's some spanish ones in here because we translate some of our audiobooks into spanish um, yeah, 27 titles. We made 11.1 on 27 books. Yeah, so 2,700 sales, 10 bounties, 
January 1st to January 31st, 2019. There's the proof. There you go. Yeah. Uh, I can turn off this. And then let's, let's not talk about us anymore. Let's talk about someone else who achieved the exact same feat as us so in the same span of time. We have a winner for the Road to 10K Challenge. Mm -hmm. And let's announce him right now. Quickly, Road to 10K Challenge, for people that don't know, we got a lot of new viewers. This is basically what we've been documenting, but we had everyone else in our in our course, Audiobook Income Academy, do the same thing and to take zero to 10K in road twos in one month as fast as possible. And there's a prize that is to get flown out to Bali uh, and just kind of hang out with us for one week and we'll treat you to like some really cool shit. Yeah. And we have a winner. Mm -hmm. We have a winner. We did an interview with him last video. Most previous video. His name is Pier Luigi from Italy. I cannot believe, like it's, it's so amazing that he did it in the same span as us and actually he made quite a lot more than us. Yeah. Right? So he made, oh let's put a screenshot on the, on the screen right now, $14,100 from audiobooks in January. And he it's not just us. It's not just us. <laughs> so he he, he uh, started his business a bit before us, like a month. He made his first book order in July, and the contest has to start only books that were published September 7th and later. So we had to subtract everything from before, and we did, and that came out to like six hundred, seven hundred dollars. So like thirteen thousand. So when so he started he the same time as us, faster. he still made thirteen thousand something yeah. in January. Yeah. And we only did eleven point one, and I thought we did we did the best we could. Yeah. We invested a lot of money. So like I'm just insanely impressed by yeah. what Pier Luigi did. But now we're always learning and we're forever getting better at this publishing shit. And oh yeah, it'll just go faster and we'll be more efficient for yeah. now. And he did 14k from audio, but from his full uh, publishing business, 19. Yeah. He did 5,000 extra from his ebooks and his paperbacks. Yeah. Uh, so we will be flying Pier Luigi out to Bali, uh, hanging out with him for a week, documenting the whole thing. Which can segue us into this final thing that we can talk about. We will be able to document the whole thing because we finally have hired a full-time video guy. His name is Dane, Dane Macbeth. He will be living with us in our villa and just serving as our full-time content guy. Yeah, so I, I spend so much time filming and editing. We suck at editing and videos. And I suck at it. We suck at filming videos. We suck at all of this video stuff. Now we finally have a guy who's gonna help us take our shit to the next level, which is a huge move. Is there much more to say in this video? It's a relatively short video, but I, like- I just wanna say congratulations to Pier Luigi, and yeah. I'm just super impressed and proud of you, and we need to talk dates. One works for you, it should definitely be after our video guy comes out, so we can document the whole thing. Mm -hmm. um, but that's all there is to say. Uh, I'll say so, we did, this is episode five, I believe, of the Road to 10K series. We're gonna end it now, because we will be taking our accounts like 20, 30K, that's the goal. But I don't want to document it like this because honestly, these videos are boring and repetitive. It's just income reports. We can give income updates, but I don't want to make more Road to 10K episodes because all we do is say, hi, look at how much we made. This is how many audiobooks we had. This is how many sales we made. Okay, moving on, bye. People love to watch the videos, but I yeah. know what you mean. But like, because like all the information, all the useful information, there's, it's not a useful video. No, it's You not. don't learn from it. All the useful information. It can is, be inspiring. It, could it can be inspiring. Help yes. You change. So, um, but all the useful videos that you could learn from, like how to actually make money from publishing, these Road to 10K videos don't do that. But like all our YouTube videos, we have a bunch of YouTube videos, and then the free training, but and then the course. Like that's and I again, it's the same message in every video. That's why I don't want to make them anymore. The message is, this shit is like really simple. It's easy. Just get into it. I like I don't want to talk more about it other than tell people to do it. I mean, there's uh, when it Does comes to publishing. Sense? Yeah, when it comes to publishing, there's nothing more to say information-wise to help you make. I the say money the same anymore. thing. I say how simple it is. I say how easy it is. How anyone can do it. How you should start doing it. It's number one thing I recommend for beginners. It's the same spiel. If we keep on making these videos, will it help us? Yes, more traffic to the course and shit like that. But I don't. I I hate just being repetitive and mm -hmm. send the same message in every video. Uh -huh. I hope that makes sense for uh -huh. viewers. Uh -huh. So oh, yeah. let's end the video on that. Let's get the puppy over here, Missy. Come here, Missy. Come here, Missy. Come here. Come on. Let's actually. Why are you? She's very chill right now. Okay, very chill right now. Let's just end it here with the magic emoji of the video. The little puppy emoji. <laughs> she pisses everywhere, but she's still super cute. Okay. Bye bye. See you in the next video.